Hi, I want to demonstrate a knot that I use uh, to tie braid to monofilament or fluorocarbon. Um, it's pretty easy to tie, very, very strong, and I, I highly recommend it. Um, so I'm going to be using, uh, we've got some, some yellow braid here, this is 50 pound test, uh, Power Pro, and I've also got some, this is just 40 pound um, test trialing big game. Um, hopefully they'll be easy to see on the, on the video. So you start by taking your, your braid and making a simple overhand loop in it. All you want to do is uh, have, a, have a single loop there because you're going to be um, using this to do double wraps around the, around the monofilament. Okay, then you take your monofilament, uh, the tag end, uh, in, uh, and lay it pointing the opposite direction as a loop, like, like this. And this end that's going to end up being where the where the clip or the lure is is going to be down that way. Now you take the uh, the braid and you wrap it around the monofilament eight or ten times. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'll try nine times. Nine. Okay. So now you've got the braid wrapped nine times around that piece of mono. You take the tag end of the mono right here and put it right through the loop that's left over. Pump on. Okay, now grab both ends of the mono and start to slowly tighten it. And you'll see it start to form your knot. And when it gets, you know, reasonably tight, you definitely want to lubricate it like most knots. Uh, you've got to be careful with braid. I've got a glove here to put on to not have the braid cut my hand. So I put my glove on and now I'm going to continue tightening down this knot. Hopefully you'll be able to see that. And now I'm pulling mainly on the main line. Okay, not so much on the tag end. And you'll see it's tighten, 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 tighten. There, and now it's locked. Now, what you want to do is trim it, and I'll tell you one of the reasons why I like this. When you trim the tag end of the mono, it's pointing toward your hook and not toward your rod. And that makes that tag end less likely to catch weeds or whatever because it's going through the water this way, and so things aren't as likely to, to snag there. Okay, and then you can just use a regular scissor or however you like to cut your braid to, uh, to trim your braid. And you can trim it very snug, very close. That was not very close. I can do it again. There. And here is your finished knot. And that is very, very, very strong. That's it, simple to tie.